All right, my green sort, my green groupers. We're talking about people who do things and words to compare, right? So what would be, where would Dancer go and where would Bigger go? Um, Fred, go ahead. Thank you for raising your hand, sir. Dancer would go under people who do things and Bigger would go under words to compare. You said bigger would go under words used to compare, right? That's the comparative form, right? Hey, guys, just for uh, just to see if you guys are on the ball today, um, superlative ending. Do you remember what that ending is? The superlative. We have the comparative ending. Gabby, what is it? It's a ending where there's more than two you, things. You compare one thing to everything, but what's the ending? If the comparative ending is er, e. E e EST, yes. That's a superlative ending, but we're doing the comparative ending. So if we do actor, where would actor fall? Where would actor fall? Hey, come on now. Fred, Fred's on the ball today, but I need I need Bella Lynn getting in, mix, in the mix. I need Atticity and Gary. Yeah, Atticity, where would actor fall? What color would I give it according to my key? Huh? It would be yellow. Okay, now let's split these syllables really quick. Dan, sir. Look at my hand. I'm putting my hand on my chin. Dan, sir. And when my hand lifts off my chin, that's where the split goes. Dan, sir. See it? Ready? Dan, split, sir. What do I pick up with? Go ahead, uh, Bella Lynn. Spell it. D A N split C E R. How about big girl? Right? There's a little rule here. Go ahead. Um, you have to separate the, the double letters. Yeah, separate the double consonants that are the same. So B, spell it, Fred. B I G G E R. No, B I G split. Oh, yeah. G E R. It says spell. Split, yeah, spell with the split. But, but multi syllable words are new to you guys. So how about. Act, act, actor. How do we do it? Split it. Yep. Actor. Yeah. We, we pick it up right on that T for sure. Actor. Actor. Yeah. How about what would beggar go? Where, where would you put the, the word beggar? Uh, Lexi. And what color would it get? Would it get? Words used to compare. Huh? Words used to compare. Words used to compare. Yes. Now, here's the thing. I'm going to go through all the words. Huh? Oh, I did? No, no. It, it should be people who do things. Yeah, that's why. Yeah, beggar. It's someone who begs, right? Okay, so let me go through all the words really quick. You ready? Settle in, folks. Settle in. You ready? We have dancer, bigger, actor, beggar, dreamer, sooner, longer, smaller, driver, farmer, burglar, trader, fresher, jogger, younger, writer, older, sailor, Smoother, swimmer, brighter, tutor, shopper, and voter. So with the people who do something, here's how you test it. If I say voter and I think, hmm, that must be someone who votes, right? That's a person who does something, right? But what about older? I would say that's comparing me to Fred. I would say I am older than Fred, right? That's comparing. Let's do one more split. Dream, dream, er, dream, er, dream, er. Uh, spell it for me, uh, Brady. With the split. D R, D R E. Dream, er. I think it's E R at the end. All right, and is it a someone who does something? Uh, yes. 
All right, you guys. So now over here on your page, let's get a page set up. Okay. We're getting a page set up. Boom. Yeah, come on. My reading groups can go on go ahead. Go ahead. So right here, we're gonna split it up just like this. Remember, we're gonna do our Monday sort, name and date at the top. Right? You guys are putting the date right here. Remember, we're gonna title it Monday sort. And then people who do something. And what's the other one? It says words used to compare. Thanks, friend. All right, you guys got it? And, and I want you to split them here. So dancer, that's someone who does something. D-A-N, split, C-E-R. And then uh, bigger, B-I-G, split, G-E-R. That's how they are going to go here, okay? All right, y'all. There you have it. Your sort is what? Sort 32, green group, Monday. Get after it.